It is finally time for May, which means that it is Regulation G in Pokemon Scarlet and Violet rank battles. Also, more importantly though, May means that on the 12th of May, this coming Sunday, is Mother's Day. You're welcome. I probably just saved somebody out there. But coming back to the ranked battles though, today we finally get to use the team that I have been harping on about for so long in actual ranked battles. And that is of course, and that is of course the Terrapagos Stellar Terra combo. Over the past month or so that I've been using this in casual battles, I have figured out the perfect way to counter some things. Specifically a lot of the things that you'll see like terrain setters like Kyogre or Trick Room users. Especially because at the start of the season, I think not a lot of people are going to know about Terrapagos and what exactly it can do. Specifically, when it terrestrializes its ability that removes any terrain and weather. And in fact, the two matches today are going to show off exactly that. So, hopefully you enjoy. And if you do, as always, liking, subscribing, commenting always helps out. A battle against some Chinese name I cannot read. Hello, Sclastria. That's some very bulky Pokemon up there. Actually, you know, again, forget about what, what they have. I don't care what they have. I'm just gonna go Whimsicott, Metagross, I'll Creamy Terrapagos. My plan is simple. I explode. Ah, uh, indeed he's so Gastrio. Uh, Psychic Terrain? Yeah, Psychic Terrain. So, I think... This is Follow Me Trick Room, yeah. I think I see a way to win this. I don't need Tailwind. They're slow. They're gonna Trick Room. I protect. I explode. Call me crazy, watch this. I get Terrapagos in next turn. They get off Trick Room, I can go for Stellar Terra, Taunt, Indeedee. Or, or, sorry, Encore. Encore um, on the Trick Room user. Okay, that's fine. Terra Dragon. That's fine, because Terra means I do super effective damage with Stellar uh, Star Storm. Explosion either KOs the Trick Room user or it doesn't. Either way, I'm happy. Because I think I still win this. Okay, gets them both low. That's fine. They're going to get Trick Room off. Glacial Lance, all right. Indeedy Trick Room, yes. Watch this. I have I have prepared for this specifically. I sent Terrapagos in. I cannot taunt on Psychic Terrain. I cannot Encore on Psychic Terrain. I can't use anything on Psychic Terrain because of Priority Prankster not working. However, despite all of this, I'm gonna do it anyway. Because with Terrapagos, I will go Stellar Terra and just protect. Actually, I could... No, 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 yeah. I need to protect. I cannot kill this Indeedee. I need it to Encore again. If he switches out, it's over. <laughs> Please don't switch out. If he switches out, it's, it's game over. It's a tragedy. He's staying... I think he's staying in, yeah. Watch this. Why am I Encoring on the Psychic Terrain? That's, that's what a foolish move to do. When you Terra with Terrapagos, it removes any sunlight or rain. It also removes the weirdness from the field. Which means, after Terrapagos protects, which means that it won't KO the Ndidi, I get to use Encore on the Ndidi, forcing it to use its last move, used move, which is gonna be, you remember what that was? Trick Room. Glacial Lance goes into Terrapagos, which is protected. Boom. That's fine. Whimsicott takes damage, I don't care. In fact, that's perfect that it, Whimsicott goes down. Whimsicott has done its job. I can get Alcremie in now, who can then use Decorate. Yes, chilling nay, I don't care, whatever. Trick Room again, gets reset. Now we're back to regular speed. And thankfully they've already been weakened from the uh, explosion from earlier, so I'm guaranteed to get a KO now with Stellar Star Storm. Especially since you're a Terra Dragon. With the speeds being reduced to normal, I can have Alcremie use Decorate on Terrapagos. You, you either have to just let your Indeedee die, because it's using negative priority Trick Room, or switch in and let me take huge damage on whatever comes in now, as I go Terra Star Storm. He's switching out. Free damage. Here we come. What's it gonna be? It's gonna be... Oh, wow. Intimidate. Who cares? Yeah, fake out. Sure. My Terrapagos has a covert cloak. Protect. I'm okay with this. I still get plus two. I'm gonna ramp up my damage no matter what. Terrapagos gets plus two attack and plus two special attack. Terra Stallstorm probably doesn't take out the Incineroar. It's probably very bulky, right? Citrus Berry, maybe a Salt Vest. Uh, or probably no. It's probably Citrus Berry, right? So we can use Parting Shot. Yep, Citrus Berry. So let me guess, he sees... Oh, I need to fake out the Terrapagos because it's going to use ter uh, Terra Star Storm again. Please, I beg of you, fake out my Terrapagos. Let me use Decorate again. Oh, withdrawing instantly? Okay, so just let me get free hits no matter what the entire time. Sure. Amoongus. Uh, I mean, Amoongus, it's in a slow... I have plus four. You're just letting me set up now. I have plus four now. 
I might even KO the Amoongus here. If not now, then on the following turn. Terra Star Swarm, say goodbye to your Acid Glacion. Glastrier. As they both go down, because we have plus four. He's going to let me get to plus six on this following turn. Incineroar is at half HP. Indeed, he's at low HP. Yes, I mean... No, in fact, you're going to send in Incineroar and Indeedee together, which sets up Psychic Terrain again, which means I can't get faked out by your Incineroar. There's the Indeedee again, setting up the Psychic Terrain. And there's the Incineroar. Oh no, Intimidate. Oh no. That's fine. I still have plus four special attack, and it will become plus six with this next Decorate. Come on, let me do it. Let me do it. In fact, I could in theory do even more damage by going for Helping Hand. Doubling the plus four. But this is more fun. I want to see the buffs go up and up and up. Oh, he's not going to let me do it. That is probably the best usage of the Terrapagos Terror I will ever use. Not just for spread Terror Starstorm, but for also removing the Psychic Terrain. The battle against Alberto. Ah, there it is. There's Kyogre. There's the... Uh, <laughs> Legendaries. Right, but it's fine though. Same thing as always. Women's Cup Metagross. Terrapagos. Alcremia. I hope though that he doesn't go Incineroar and Fake Out though. That's the only concern. Please go something else. <laughs> Don't bring out a Fake Out. Tornadus Landorus. Please, go. Ah, I'm okay with this as well. This is perfect actually. He sets up Rain right now. Remember, the Rain will be removed when I Terra with my Terrapagos. It's Tailwind. Explosion. I don't care if I lose both my Pokemon here. Tailwind, we match with ours. It's okay. Water spot. I'm, I'm alright with this. Actually, mmm. Wait a minute. Am I alright with this? Metagross goes down. Arr. Needed Whimsicott to go down as well. It's fine. Terrapagos can protect one turn. We can stall this out a little bit, and then we'll be okay. In fact, honestly, let me... Uh, call me crazy. Let me Encore Tornadus. Just to make sure he doesn't do anything else other than just Tailwind again. Alright. Kyogre's also gonna protect. Uh, hmm... Tornadus use Rain Dance. Oh, wow. What? Did he expect me to go for the, the the Terror and try and reset the Rain already? Oh, does he, does he, is he aware? Okay, that's actually kind of bad then, because Kyogre now... <gasps> Wait. I can Encore the Kyogre. I can Encore the Kyogre. Oh, my, you fool. Yes, this works perfectly for us. And then I Stellar Terror Star Swarm. This is okay. This works. And if he, if he tries to Encore my... If he tries to do anything... To my Whimsicott with his Tornadus. It's fine because I have... Uh, what's it called? Mental Herb. I mean, I guess he could also Encore me into protecting, but yeah, it's fine. Rain Dance again. I'm alright with this. Because you will not be able to use Water Spout again. Because I am going to Encore you into Protect. Please don't actually get your double Encore. Oh, okay, uh, double Protect? Okay, good. Terra Star Storm. Ideally, this doesn't KO. Because these two aren't threats to me. Honestly. I want to switch Whimsicott in to get Alcremia in so I can start decorating. And then we Terra Star Storm again. Wait, no. I've encored them both. They're stuck doing Rain Dance Protect. They are useless this turn. Yeah, he has to withdraw. Which means free trip damage. Landorus comes in. with Yeah, double withdraw. That's fine. Because now they get weak. And now I just go for Decorate and then uh, Stellar Star Storm on the following turn. Booster Energy Flutter. Speed? Speed. I mean, it's okay. I think I can tank out a hit with my uh, Terrapagos, right? Terra Star Storm. Does this even get a KO on the Flutter? Flutter is frail after all, right? So... Let's see it. Ah, no, not enough. Tailwind Peters out. I was, I was also Peters out. Uh, honestly, I can decorate Terrapagos. Oh, is Terrapagos Foster? Because maybe I can switch back into Whimsicott and have it use Tailwind again. And protect for now. No, I think we're Foster. Ah, oh, this is gonna be a bad mistake. Icy Wind. Oh, Icy Wind! Does lower our speeds. Fudge Bomb onto Alcremie. We survive, that's important, that's huge. Terra Star Storm. Uh, decorate. This is fine, this is fine, this is fine. Because here's what happens. I protect Terrapagos. Alcremie has to die this turn. And then uh, I get Prankster Worms got back in. This is perfectly fine by me. Unless he's smart and he doubles into my Terrapagos. Icy Wind. Fake Tears. Ooh, Fake Tears. Interesting. Sludge Bomb into the Alcremie. Perfect. You fool. This gives me a free switch in back into Whimsicott, which means... Tailwind Prankster. Tailwind with Whimsicott, and now it's just game over. 
they're all weakened from Terra Star Storm, so these two go down. Once Kyogre Landorus comes back in, they also go down. There's Prankster to Tailwind. You know what that means. I mean, we did have minus one. Oh, actually, hang on. We're at minus two now from the two icy winds. Do we still go before with Terrapica? Yes, we do. Okay, good, 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 good. That actually was kind of scary. I guess they do have... No, 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 it's fine. They can send Landorus back in with Kyogre, and Landorus... Oh, Tornadus does have Prankster Tailwind, but I can just ta uh, taunt that, right? Rain stops, which is going to get reset. That's fine. We're, we're all right. We're all right. We're all right. Kyogre... Ooh, actually, Kyogre does have a lot of health still. Let's go for a taunt on the Tornadus. We are only at uh, plus two attack. Wait, what? Oh wait, Terrapicus is at neutral speed still. Oh, that's fine then. I think we still, yeah. We taunt Tornadus and then we Terra Star Storm, we should be fine. Are you actually gonna Terra? Are you actually gonna Terra your Kyogre? You realize Stellar Star Storm is gonna do more damage, right? Uh, assuming I go first, right? Hopefully I will go first. If, he, if I don't, then he might actually KO me with Water Spout here. But I mean, I have Tailwind though, right? Taunt, yep. Cuts down Tornadus. Yep, there we go, can't use Tailwind. And that let, that means I can go Terra Star Storm. Thank you for going Stellar Terra. I don't think this would have mattered, because I did a plus two now. But that does mean it's super effective on you. See, this team is more than just Unga Bunga. Oh, let me just click this. Sometimes you do have to use your brain a bit. And that's how you get wins like this. But of course, you can also just go Unga Bunga. <laughs> So hopefully though, uh, you all enjoyed this team and I shall see you all next time.